two well-known figures from the WWE backstage area are allegedly not present at WWE Survivor Series, War Games, which fans are eagerly anticipating. An old hand in the industry thinks this may be problems for Triple H. Bruce Pritchard and Michael Hayes are the two individuals whose names are being debated. Their absence is probably being felt, given how important the two are behind the scenes. The rumor mills continue to churn, even if Pritchard and Hayes are likely to return. On the Smack Talk program hosted by Sportskeeda Wrestling, Dutch Mantel was questioned about his thoughts on the names that were not present. He had the impression that WWE, despite its massive gear, could function autonomously. In spite of his support system, Triple H couldn't help but long for the presence of the principal architects, Pritchard and Hayes, who were integral parts of that fluid system. Dutch Mantle believes that worse things may happen, even if Bruce Pritchard and Michael Hayes are major figures behind the scenes and are now missing. During the same segment of Sportskeeda Wrestling's Smack Talk program, the former WWE star shared his thoughts and said that it would have been worse to lose a couple superstars. There is an electric buzz among WWE fans as the promotion prepares for Survivor Series, a highlight event of the year. The stakes have never been greater than they are now that the much-loved War Games contest is available on pay-per-view. But behind the scenes, Triple H, Paul Levesque, WWE's chief content officer, is supposedly under a lot of strain due to the absence of two major stars, Randy Orton and Drew McIntyre. An experienced insider claims that their absence has caused the organization to scramble, resulting in last-minute adjustments that may have a significant influence on the event's outcome. One of WWE's most recognizable faces, Randy Orton, has been out since May 2022 with a back issue. Despite speculation that Orton would make a comeback before Survivor Series, new information indicates that his recuperation schedule is still up in the air. People were anticipating a watershed moment with Orton's comeback, according to his magnetic personality and unmatched in-ring psychology. Many fans were hoping he would have a major plot point, such as a pivotal role in a war games bout or a return to his tag team relationship with Riddle. Orton's absence is felt most keenly in high-profile matchups, when the stakes are often raised by virtue of his star power and history. Triple H views Randy as a cornerstone of WWE storytelling, an experienced source said in an exclusive interview. The loss of one of the most adaptable performers in the industry due to his departure would surely add stress to the process of rearranging priorities. Another prominent figure who has been noticeably absent from television in the last few weeks is Drew McIntyre. With ease, the Scottish warrior has gone from main event feuds to upper mid-card confrontations, proving to be an important part of WWE schedule. He is an invaluable addition to any pay-per-view event because to his charismatic personality and tough exterior. Last time we saw McIntyre, he was embroiled in a bitter rivalry with Seth Rollins for the title of World Heavyweight Champion. Speculation arose after his crown jewel loss that he may turn evil, join Judgment Day, or go it alone. Nevertheless, with ongoing speculation over his contract situation, his absence has heightened worries regarding his future intentions inside WWE. And source said, McIntyre has been positioned as a keystone for big stories. In his absence, WWE will have to rethink the lineup for Survivor Series. It's clear that the stage is missing Drew because of his exceptional flexibility. Since becoming WWE's chief content officer in 2022, Triple H has done an excellent job of reimagining the company's approach to storytelling. Both fans and reviewers have praised Triple H's reinvigoration of the product, which he attributes to his careful planning and focus on long-term narrative. But the unexpected nature of wrestling even gets the best of him. One of the big four pay-per-views in WWE, Survivor Series is vital to the company's momentum as it approaches WrestleMania. Triple H probably had to change his plans on the fly after losing Wharton and McIntyre.
two big stars in the weeks leading up to the event. Retaining fan interest while reshuffling big matchups is a struggle for Triple H, according to the Senior Insider. No feud would be complete without the star power and credibility that Orton and McIntyre bring to the table. Without them, WWE will need to be inventive, which isn't always simple when time is of the essence. WWE is already working to change the Survivor Series schedule. Two of WWE's most powerful factions, the Judgment Day and the Bloodline, now figure prominently in the event's signature wargames contests. The absence of Orton and McIntyre, however, changes the way these encounters feel. Some have speculated that Triple H may add in NXT talent or other returning stars to make up the roster. Also, the event's star power is expected to be delivered by big stars like Cody Rhodes, Seth Rollins, and Roman Reigns. Although these superstars are more than capable of carrying the program, viewers who want diversity may find that the lack of Orton and McIntyre diminishes the number of exciting new rivalries and matches. As Survivor Series approaches, members of the WWE Universe have voiced both their anticipation and their worries. Despite the high-stakes drama that WarGames claims to provide, many fans are disappointed that Orton and McIntyre aren't there. Many on social media have speculated that Orton may yet pull a surprise comeback during the event, adding fuel to the fire of speculation regarding possible shocks. Some are worried that McIntyre's apparent discontent with his present booking or other underlying difficulties would be revealed by his absence. Fans are hopeful that Triple H's creative team can pull off an unforgettable spectacle, despite these reservations. Despite many obstacles, WWE has maintained a constant level of quality in its pay-per-view productions under his supervision. His versatility has been praised by many, who highlight to his knack for promoting mid-card talent to main event roles. Additionally, WWE's star power dependence is exposed by Orton and McIntyre's absence. The firm has a long list of talent, but its big events are usually hosted by a select few. This incident exemplifies how plans may be swiftly derailed by injuries, contract conflicts, and personal matters. The significance of creating new stars and expanding narratives is highlighted by this fact. Even while WWE stars like Gunther, Damian Priest, and Ella Knight have become household names, the company can't afford to become too dependent on these stars and their offspring. Fans wonder what will happen to Orton and McIntyre now that they're not around. How soon Orton can play again depends on how well he recovers from his injury, but when he does return, it will be a huge deal. It is unclear whether he will return to his status as a major event participant or take on the role of a seasoned coach. It seems like McIntyre's case is more complicated. It would be devastating for WWE to lose one of its top performers if his alleged contract problems were the cause of his absence. If his long-term function in the organization is clearly communicated and all sides are on the same page, a heel flip or a new character direction might revitalize his career. Survivor Series is quickly approaching, and Triple H and his squad have a formidable obstacle in the form of Randy Orton and Drew McIntyre's absence. But it's also a chance for WWE to demonstrate how resilient and creative they are. Survivor Series can still be a memorable event for WWE if the company focuses on captivating narrative, promotes new stars, and delivers high-stakes drama. The mystery surrounding Orton and McIntyre heightens the interest of the fans. Although their absence is noticeable, the suspense is maintained by the thought of unforeseen twists or surprise reappearance. Everything is possible in WWE, and the build-up to Survivor Series is sure to be just as exciting.